Oh, oh I got to get that stretch in. Oh, that was an amazing sleep. What an amazing bed. Oh, I feel so refreshed now. Oh, I'm ready for anything Jarvis or any of the Mind Avengers have to throw at me. Let's put this suit on nice and quick. Let's get this bad boy on. Oh yeah. Oh, that feels good. Okay. Yeah, I'm super fast. I'm super everything. Hey, what is that? What is going on over there? Is that Cap? What? Was that a fish? Oh, no. Oh no. This, this cannot be happening. What is going... Cap, what is going on? Oh, hey, morning, Stark. How are you? Um, I had one of the most amazing sleeps of my life, but maybe I'm still asleep and this is a nightmare because why is my pool full of fish? Hey, what's wrong, buddy? I'm just getting some practice in. I love fishing. Getting some practice? Getting some practice in. We live right beside the ocean. We are surrounded by it. Go down yeah. there. But come on, Stark. I gotta make practice makes perfect. I keep here, I catch some fish, then when I go to sea, I'll definitely catch some more. Oh, Cap, you are just so old. <laughs> You're so uptight, man. Come on, it's fun. You should try it. Yeah, hey, give me a go with that rod. Show me that rod. <laughs> I wanna go. <laughs> Let me see. Hey, where is it? Where'd the rod go? There it is. So what do I do? Just throw it out? Throw it out. Steve. Hey! You hey, I got a bite. I got a bite. Hey. Oh, no. <laughs> I, I, I didn't catch him. He doesn't want to come with me. Okay, come on, Stark. Hey, we should go to see what Jarvis has to say. Yeah, actually, that's a good idea. We better check in with Jarvis. Let's go inside. Hey, Jarvis, what's up, buddy? Good morning, sir. How are you? I see you were enjoying some fishing this morning. Uh, yeah, you saw that. We got a couple of nibbles, but um, we didn't get catch anything, so it was it was an unsuccessful fishing trip. So. Unfortunately, we're going to have to have something else for, for food tonight. That's no problem, sir. I'll have the chefs rustle up something delicious. I am glad you checked in, though. We've had a distress call from the Infinity City Hospital. Whoa. That doesn't sound good at all. Anything to do with hospital and distress call, like those two things should not be in the same sentence. That's not good at all. Have you got any information for me? Unfortunately, sir, that was it. The call was very vague. I think you should take Captain America and go see what you can okay. do. I think if we're going to the hospital, we may bring Dr. Steve with us. I mean, he is the best doctor in the world, so it will always be good to have him as a second opinion. Okay, thanks a lot, Jarvis. We're going to go and get Dr. Steve. Let's do it, Cap. Ah, I see Dr. Steve. He's right in here, Cap. Let's go in and tell him what's up. Cool. Hey, Doc. Listen, we got a problem. We just got a distress call from the hospital in Infinity City. Jarvis just told us that there's a serious problem there. We're going to need you to come with us, is that okay? Ah yes, my good friend Dr. Jones is the head doctor there. It will be nice to see him even if it is under these circumstances. I hope things aren't too bad. Well, so do I. What about you, Cap? That's good that you're coming, Dr. Steve. The safety and well-being of our citizens is number one priority, especially the ones that are unwell. So let's get there. Yeah, he's right. Okay, Doc. You gather any supplies you need, and let's go. Come on, let's do this, my Avengers. Okay, Cap, I'm just coming in for landing. Hey, Stark. Hey, there you are. Hey, how did Dr. Steve... Oh, did you put him on the back of your cycle? He came on my bike. We got here pretty fast. Okay, that's cool. Whoa, that sun's setting pretty quick. Let's get inside, guys, and see what's up. Okay, here's a nurse. See what she has to say. Hey, who is this? Let's see. Nurse Sally. Oh, good. The Mind Avengers. There's something very strange going on in the hospital. We have had a lot of extra patients today, and now I cannot reach any of the doctors on the upper floors. What? Hmm. That's strange. Let's check around that down here first and see what's up. does sound a bit strange. And let's see what's up. Hmm. It's very quiet, Stark. Yeah, it really is. Why is there nobody in any of these rooms down here? Can you find anyone? No, no one's around at all. Hey, let's check up the next floor. Yeah, okay, that sounds like a plan. Let's go. Race it! Oh, uh, yeah, I won the race. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Come on, serious face. Let's go, Stark. I, I don't have a serious face. You know that. <laughs> hey, in here. Here's a patient. Oh, wow. whoa. Let's talk to he, this guy. He looks pretty sick. He does look pretty sick. Let's see what he says. Oh. Hey, it's a girl. It's Lily. 
Ugh, I I've been bitten. I don't know what is wrong with me. What? Bitten? Like it's so strange. What's going on here, Stark? Like a dog bite, maybe, or a... I don't yeah, know. Maybe, maybe. It does seem pretty quiet still. Let's check this room over here. Okay, there's another nurse in here. Let's see what she has to say. This is a nice office. Well, there's another patient. Ugh. Those guys look really bad, Cap. No. Hello, good citizen. Let's see what she has to say. There is something strange going on in this hospital. Mm, yeah, we already heard that. We can't communicate with any of the upper floors. We heard that as well in the lower floor. Also, these patients are extremely sick and we can't figure out what's wrong with them. This man seems to have been bitten. What? Is it like some sort of crazed pack of wolves or ducks this going around? This is all too familiar, Stark. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on here, but I think we should talk to maybe a head doctor. Let's see what this nurse says. Hey, here we go. Whoa, that was a good hunch, Cap. Go talk to our head doctor. Dr. Jones is a genius. If anyone knows what to do, it's him. Okay, so where is Dr. Jones? Hey, Please. there we go. Dr. Jones' office. Over here. Ah, there he is. Okay, let's get Steve in here because Steve knows this guy. Okay, let's go talk to Dr. Jones. Hey, Dr. Jones. I'm Iron Man. This is Captain America. And this over here is Dr. Steve. I believe you already know him. Well, yes, Dr. Steve, how are you, my friend? We go way back. And Mind Vengers, it is great to meet you. It's good to meet you, too. Anyway, what's going on here, Doc? What's happening? Well, to be honest, I'm not quite sure myself. I had a call from Dr. Phil from upstairs. He's a great doctor. He informed me that there was a viral infection and that the patients, they, they started to bite one another. It's very, very strange, but he said under no circumstances was I to go to the third floor or higher, and I'm not quite sure why. I think it would be great if you could go find Dr. Phil. Yeah, okay. This this place, it seems really spooky, but at least that solves the, the biting situation. I mean, we thought it might have been dogs or something, but patients biting other patients and doctors? This is crazy. That, that doesn't sound good, Stark, does it? Okay, I think we should probably go upstairs maybe and uh, and see if this Dr. Phil can help us out. All right, Cap, come on, let's go upstairs. I mean, patients biting patients? That's so strange, Cap. I know, man, it's, I don't get it. Like, what's going on? We gotta get to the bottom of this, Stark. Yeah, I know, it's strange. Let's check all these rooms. They seem deserted. Yeah, again, it's just so quiet up here. What's let's going get... on? Uh, hey, it looks like barricades on the stairs. What's that? What do you mean barricades on the stairs? What Stark, is going on? Over here! Oh no! Who's this guy? Oh my gosh! Sir, are you okay? Uh, no. I, I've, I've been injured. I've been... I, I think I've been bitten. I don't know. I can't really remember. That That's not good. What What's going on up there? There seems to be a lot of blood. Uh, I don't know. Were, were you talking to... Talking to Dr. Jones at all? Yeah, we, we've been in contact with Dr. Jones. He said to come try find Dr. Phil. Yeah, that's that's me. I'm I'm head of surgery. I'm, I'm Dr. Phil. Uh, unfortunately, we were operating on a patient and... Uh, I'm sorry, it's hard for me to speak, but... Uh, we were operating on a patient and... We thought we had him under an anesthetic, but... He seemed to have just come back to life and... He just bit me. And I can't really remember much, but... We barricaded up up the stairs there because it seems as though all the patients have turned and they're... I don't know what's going on. I, I, I'm not sure. I've never seen anything like this. Maybe you guys should check it out. Quickly. Whoa. Okay, Cap. You heard him. Let's get upstairs. Okay, Stark. Whoa. Watch Whoa. out. Whoa. What are these? Stark, it's my worst fears. They look like zombies. Oh, no. That's not good. Stark, get back. You don't know what you're dealing with. We gotta talk to Dr. Phil again. Okay. Back up, back up. I do not like zombies. Hey, Dr. Phil, I hope you're feeling okay, but I've got some bad news. I think it is zombies. Ah, oh, no. My worst fear, it's come true. I thought as much. Okay, listen up. I was bitten about two hours ago, so... Oh, by my calculations, I should have turned about an hour and a half ago, but I haven't. I think maybe I'm immune to the zombie infection. If you take uh, a small vial of my blood, maybe a small little sample, and take it down to Dr. Jones, I'm pretty sure he might be able to find an antidote. That guy's a genius. 
Okay, that sounds great. You hang in there, buddy. We'll get you some help. Stark, let's go. Guys, we just got back from talking to Dr. Phil. It's not good up there. He's in a pretty bad way. He thinks it's a zombie attack. I've got this. It's a, it's a vial of his blood. He said you could use it to maybe create an antidote? Stark, what do you think we should do from here? Well, I think if we leave Dr. Steve and Dr. Jones in here together, that's a good idea. We're going to have to barricade up this, uh, this wall here, so then this doorway is totally barricaded up. Also, if you look here, outside, there's plenty of areas for these zombies to escape. We can't let that happen. So we got to try and find a nearby hardware store or something like that where we can get supplies and tools and stuff so we can barricade it off perfectly so we can quarantine this area off. Does that sound like a plan to you, Cap? Great thinking, Stark. Good job. Let's go do that. Let's do it. Come on. Hey, Stark, down here. I found the hardware store. Ah, yes. Yeah. should. I see you. Oh, no. Why, why is it barricaded? They must have got word of the zombies. We can't let this get out. Oh no, we can't let everybody know about it. Break that, break it down, quickly. We gotta get I'm in here. I'm true, come on. Okay. We've got some tools on the wall, I think we do. Okay, let's just check these chests, see what we can find. Yeah, okay. Ah, I found some stuff. Awesome. I got like ladders, I'm gonna take loads of ladders, fences, we're gonna need them. Iron yeah. bars, we're gonna need them I got them some too. fences, I got some barbed wire. Whoa, I got more ladders. Oh, I got some TNT. What's a hardware store doing with TNT? That's insane. <laughs> Maybe for demolition. Right, we got some barbed wire, some nether brick fence. What else did you pick up? I just got some fences and barbed wire. Okay. That should be enough to block off the roads and the doorways. Ah. All finished. Hey, Cap, how are you getting on? I'm just laying the last bits of barbed wire now. Ah, I can see that. Um, yeah, my side is so much better. <laughs> Stark, it's always a competition with you. Okay, come on, let's get back to the guys. Okay, let's get upstairs. Remember, we have got to barricade those guys in as well. We cannot yeah. get any zombies getting anywhere near them. Hey, I've no supplies left. Have you got anything? I've got it sorted. Let me just... Okay, guys. Keep working. I know. We can trust you. Let's go. Okay, let me put barbed wire... Yeah, that's around it. ...around here. Well, and good job. And then I put some barricades. Nice. I'm gonna lock these guys in pretty tight. Put some fences. Okay, more barbed wire. They're never getting through this, Stark. No, not, not a chance. Actually, how are we going to get through? <laughs> Stark, we're pretty strong. We'll bust this thing down, no problem. Oh, I know, I know. But no zombies are getting through there. That's the main thing. Wow, that is one awesome, awesome barricade. Guys, we'll come back for you, we swear. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's get upstairs. Let's get upstairs and see how Dr. Phil's doing. Cap, come on, hurry! Whoa! Where's Dr. Phil? Hey, Stark, over here, there's a trail! Oh my god, what's going on? Whoa, this guy is tough! He dragged himself the whole way in here, that is so awesome! Hey buddy, you hang tight, we're gonna go upstairs and see what's up. Hey, Cap, have you got anything else left over to I make- I sure you... do, I'm gonna barricade him in, keep him Whoa, safe! Whoa, that is cool, you barricade that guy up. We gotta get through these barricades up here. These zombies look insane. Cap, quick, get up there and take down that barricade. Nice and quick. I'm on it. Go, take it out. Whoa, you got it. Whoa, these guys are tough. Whoa. Cap, quick. Oh my goodness, what? Oh, he's so strong. Stark, these guys. Stark, no. Cap, are you okay? <laughs>